Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time tuning in, my name is Angel Marino, but you can call me Mac Daddy. And in today's video, I'm super excited because I'm gonna be sharing some really awesome makeup hacks using the brand new Nova Beauty Lip Collection. Now, if you guys missed my Nova Beauty haul, I will link it down below. You guys definitely have to check out that video. I give you guys all the tea, break everything down, everything you need to know about this lip collection from Nova Beauty. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I'm like addicted to TikTok. And one of the things that I've noticed in beauty TikTok is all of these crazy makeup hacks. And I'm always sitting there like scrolling, literally like in the middle of the night when I should be asleep, but I'm just like, you know, withering away on TikTok. And I see all these crazy makeup hacks and I'm always like, okay, where are people coming up with these hacks from? Do they really, really work? And I feel like sometimes they don't and they're just super, super gimmicky. And I said, you know what? No. How about we give people some actual makeup hacks that actually work, that actually look good. So that's exactly what we're gonna do today. But before we get started, don't be shady. Be a lady, you guys already know the drill. Make sure you guys subscribe to this channel. Make sure you guys turn on the notifications so you guys don't miss a beat or any new uploads. And make sure you guys thumbs up this video and let me know what kind of videos you guys wanna see on my YouTube channel. And without further ado, let's get started. I'm sure you guys know cream blush has been all the rage. It's been super trending. I feel like every makeup brand at this point has released their own variation, their own kind of cream blush. I'm gonna show you guys how to get that cream blush look using these Nova Beauty lipsticks. We're gonna take two lipsticks in satin finishes. I have them right here in front of me. I have shade Reset, which is like a really beautiful, like bright orange color. I wanted to create more of like a corally, kind of like orange vibe. So we're actually gonna mix two colors to customize the look that we want. So this is the shade Reset. And I'm also picking up this shade Dream, which is kind of like more of like a neutrally, kind of like peachy tone. So we're gonna mix these two together to create the perfect kind of like corally, peachy cream blush. So I'm gonna do this by running these lipsticks on the back of my hand. I'm gonna go back and forth until I get the perfect color before we actually start applying. So here we are, this is reset, and I'm just gonna run this on the back of my hand. The back of our hand is always a good palette, I feel, and it's gonna warm up the color, it's gonna warm up that creaminess of the lipstick, and it's just gonna be like the perfect place for us to just really work off of. So here we go, you guys can see it is nice and bright. You guys can see that sheen, that texture, nice and creamy, which is exactly what we want. Now we're gonna go in with that lighter shade. We're just gonna mix on top until we get the perfect color that we want. And you guys can see how it like really toned down that like bright orange. If you guys do want it to be brighter, you can go back in with the orange lipstick. If you wanna tone it down, you guys can go with like the lighter lipstick. You definitely are in control here as far as the color that you want and how you want it to look. Now I know that cream blush can be a little intimidating. I know, trust me, I know I've had some spooky moments, but I would definitely say the best way to apply this is gonna be with the makeup sponge. So I'm gonna pick it up from the back of my hand with the makeup sponge first before we apply it directly onto our cheek. As you guys can see, I'm lightly just kind of like picking it up. I'm saturating the back of my makeup sponge just ever so lightly and then we're just gonna lightly and I do mean lightly because you do want to work in increments start to build this color onto our cheeks by just patting it on. Now I do like with my application I do like to bring this almost like up around my eyes and we're just gonna start to just pat this like I said all over our cheek and now I'm gonna take a clean side of the blender and I'm just gonna lightly diffuse wherever there's any harshness, wherever it's not blended, to make sure that we have like a really nice smooth application. Nice little dewy ting. And we're gonna do the same thing on the other side. Oh, that is so pretty, oh my gosh. Literally, after this hack, you're never gonna need cream blush ever again. Okay, so I love how this looks. You guys can leave it like this. I'm gonna go ahead and leave it like this because I'm really liking this like dewy finish vibe, but you guys can totally set it with like a powder blush. You can even set it with a little bit of like a translucent powder, but I definitely, definitely love how this is looking. If you guys give this a try, let me know in the comments what you think. Another huge trend that has been a trend for the longest time I feel is faux freckles. And we are going to achieve faux freckles using none other than the Nova Beauty Snatched Lip Liners. So I'm going in with shade Brown 2. Now this is gonna be the perfect product to create faux freckles for a number of different reasons. It's not gonna transfer, it's smudge proof. Now I'm gonna take this liner and I'm just gonna press it like right in the center of my face right in here, like above my nose, kind of like underneath this area here, because this is kind of where I want to create that faux freckle look and vibe. And I'm just gonna do this by lightly just kind of like patting into my skin, just kind of holding it there, giving it a nice little baby little twist. And I like to go and create like a nice dimension of different sizes just to make it look more realistic. 
Then after I apply them, I like to go in with my finger and just lightly tap to just soften them up to make them look less harsh and again, more realistic. And you can go ahead and add as many as your heart desires, but I feel like this is pretty good for me. I still want it to feel a little like realistic, if you will. And fun fact, actually, I actually naturally really do have freckles, but sometimes because of the makeup, they do get covered up. So it's nice to be able to have the option to just kind of like add a few back in there, you know, just like sprinkle some on there, if you will. And honestly, this does not need to be perfect. Just have fun. Again, you can really decide how many you want, if you want a lot, if you want a little, but I love how this looks. It's so easy to do and I think it looks so freaking cute. And for our last makeup hack, I'm gonna show you guys how to take a Nova Beauty lipstick and transform it into a cream eyeshadow. Now, I'm sure you guys have seen cream shadows everywhere. Again, it's one of those products that I feel like a lot of brands have launched. Today, I'm gonna be using this lipstick in the shade Real. This is one of their matte finished lipsticks. I picked this one because it's like a nice warm brown. So I feel like it's just gonna look really, really pretty with my brown eyes. And this is literally, you guys, so easy to do. So for this hack, honestly, what's really key is your tools. So I'm gonna take a brush. You wanna use something that's fluffy and dense at the same time. I'm gonna be using this brush right here and I'm lightly just going to start to just go onto the tip of the lipstick with the tips of the bristles of this brush. I'm gonna do this kind of like by patting it first, almost like we're like laying down that color before we start to go in and blend. I can already see that pigment. And you see that pigment? Girl, Nova Beauty is not playing with y'all. I'm really going back and forth like a windshield wiper motion, but making sure that I'm also moving it in circles as I'm doing that to make sure that everything looks nice and blended and really beautifully diffused. And I'm just taking my finger and lightly patting out any harsh edges just to make sure that it looks beautifully diffused. I don't know which hack I love the most, but I am literally gagging over the way this looks. I think the tone, this color is so beautiful on the eyes. You guys definitely need to try this hack. And now we're just gonna even out the other eye because we don't want to look uneven. And again, just running my bristles on the tip of that lipstick. And now we're gonna go to work. Is it just me or do my eyes look like lighter with this on my eyes? I really feel like it made my eyes look lighter. I am obsessed with how this looks. All right guys, and that pretty much completes these beauty hacks. I honestly feel like these beauty hacks are real, they're functional, and I honestly think if you guys give these a try, you're gonna be pleasantly surprised. Make sure you guys check out Nova Beauty, and make sure you guys check out their beautiful collection of lip products that you guys can see work for way more than just your lips. They're available right now. Make sure you guys go to the website and shop. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys pick anything up. Again, I'm really, really feeling everything that we use in today's video. I'll leave everything in the description box so you guys know everything that I use. And let me know if you guys want another beauty hack video. Thank you guys so much for being here. I appreciate you and I will see you in my next one. Bye guys.